All right, people, we're going to be doing the, uh, we're going to be doing the, uh, we're going to be doing the uh, NFL Pips, of course, and uh, week 15. Uh, let's get on with this. Try being a band, it's, it's, it's too hard. Yeah, it's too hard. It's too hard. I was getting out with this. <clears throat> Week numero numero fourteen. Real quick, though, we gotta go over last week's picks. Got Thursday night game right. Got Green Bay. Uh, Tim Bay won. Tim, uh, Arizona won. Bengals won. Jets won. Uh, the Dolphins won. Chiefs won. Broncos won. Panthers won. Steelers won. I was incorrect. Chicago won. Uh, Seahawks won big time. Texans lost. Uh, Eagles won. And Washington lost. So. Hold on, gotta let out Pigsville. On to the uh, outside world. Alright, hold on. Wow. It's broke the freaking lamp. Alright, what's up? On to week number 14, of course. Uh, all right. Um, okay. Thursday night game. Minnesota and Arizona. i uh, pick Arizona. Arizona is probably going to whoop, whooping this team if Minnesota plays like they did against Seattle. I honestly wasn't expecting that against Seattle. I thought they'd be able to beat Seattle with their good defense, and um, quite frankly, they got their ass kicked. Apparently, shutting down AP or shuts down the offense. So, um, hmm. really don't know what to say to that. That was pretty bad. Uh, pick Arizona. Arizona's uh, offense is just, it's probably the best offense right now, but Pittsburgh is just a tad behind it. But if they're neck to neck, but it's close. If healthy, Pittsburgh's offense is the best. <laughs> Buffalo going to Philly. Reunite. The reunization of uh, the reuniting of uh, LaShawn McCoy and Philly. I like Buffalo. Now, did Philly really beat New England or New England beat themselves? Your answer, New England beat themselves. Interception in the red zone, which they never do. Never a lot of baseball team plays. They beat themselves. And yet, Philly almost let them come back with an outside kick and almost went overtime. So, what's that tell you about Philly? Fluke. Pick ball flow on that one to win. Seattle going to Baltimore. This was a Sunday night game one point. It actually, I thought it would be one of the best games of the year. But, until we uh, got into the season and uh, Baltimore kind of sucked. And along with the fact of all the injuries they have, it got flexed to one o'clock game. Pick Seattle, obviously. No way they're gonna get let down this week. They're gonna move on to eight and five, or uh, yeah, they're seven and five right now. So um, yeah, they're seven and five. So they're gonna wait for eight and five. San Fran going to Cleveland. Cleveland's uh, stadium's gonna be full of Niner fans. But quite frankly, if I was a Cleveland fan, I wouldn't even go. Not much to see. You're two and ten. Season's over. Probably going to be 2-14 and 3-13. I don't know if they're going to win another game. Pick San Fran. The way they're playing, they're playing pretty decent. Detroit at St. Louis. Eh, I like Detroit in this one. They've been playing a lot better ball than they were re earlier in the year. St. Louis has gone down the drain. Their offense sucks. Gurley, you know, he had his little explosive explosion, but, you know, he's a rookie. He can't be an all-star at this level yet. Uh, pick Detroit. Uh, I don't really know what the score is going to be. Picking the scores are damn near impossible. 
Tennessee going to New York. I'm rooting for Tennessee, but unfortunately, New York will win that one. Uh, I believe uh, New York's not really playing that good, but I think they can play good enough to beat Tennessee. But Tennessee can make this game close for sure. But still, the Jets will win that one, I believe. Pittsburgh going to Cincinnati for round two. Uh, again, I will be picking Pittsburgh. Uh, Cincinnati, you know, they uh, they kicked Cleveland's ass, but so do we. Pittsburgh's offense is on all cylinders right now, scoring 30 points and three games straight now, I think. Um, before Cleveland, it was Oakland before Oakland. It was the Bengals, so 30, 38, then 30. Oh, shit, that's four games in a row. Four games in a row, 30 points or more. Uh, definitely, uh, Pittsburgh's offense is playing a lot better. Ben will not be, he'll be 100, close to 100%. You know, he ain't going to be 100% until offseason, but he's playing. He'll be a lot better than he was last time, so I expect Pittsburgh to beat Cincinnati. So, though, this will be a close game. It will be a close game for sure. Indianapolis going to Jacksonville. I like Jacksonville. Uh, their offense is playing as one of the better units in the league. Defense still sucks, but I think they can beat Hasselback. So take Jacksonville. Oh, San Diego going to Kansas City. Kansas City right now, listen, is one of the best teams in the league. Arguably, I could say honestly, they could probably, uh, I think when they get in the playoffs, yeah, they're going to go to the playoffs. Uh, I think they're going to go into playoffs, and I think they have. A, I think they can beat New England. Let me tell why. Alex Smith is a game manager, mind you. He's not good for third and long, but he manages the game. He doesn't turn the ball over, and they can they can run the ball, and they have a pretty good defense. So that's the formula to beating Brady. I think they have a chance. Uh, I think they can. They don't have the offensive firepower, but if they just if they have a good running game, they will. They can beat anybody. I'm not joking either. They can beat almost anyone. They're playing pretty good, and they're on like a six-game six game winning streak right now. They're playing pretty good. So pick Kansas City in that one. They will not lose at home. Uh, Washington going to Chicago. I like Washington. Even though that game was pathetic last night, that was a horrible game. They need to be able to flex the Monday night. They need to be able to flex the Monday night game because that was total bullshit. Or to watch that game, I feel sorry for her. I like Washington, though, to come out and beat Chicago. Uh, Atlanta going to F Carolina. Carolina will win that one. Atlanta sucks. They're 6-6. Six and six. Like I predicted, they would lose to Tampa Bay, and they did. Uh, their offense sucks. Matt Ryan's playing that good, and their defense sucks. They have no sacks, really. They suck. So, uh, pick Carolina. New Orleans going to Tampa Bay. Uh, I like uh, Tampa Bay in this one. New Orleans defense is trash. Pretty good offense, but there are defenses. It's it's bad. Brandon Browner's Brandon Browner's terrible. It's just it's bad. James Winston's playing pretty good, and uh, you know they they're winning games. So I like Tampa Bay in that one. Oakland going to Denver. I like Denver to win close game. Though Oakland's playing, they're playing better. They'll make it close, but I think Denver will win a close one. Dallas going to Green Bay. Green Bay should kick Dallas' ass, but they could make it close because Dallas' defense isn't that bad. I like Green Bay, though, to win. Uh, I don't know. I feel like Aaron Rodgers might go off. New England going to Houston. New England could lose this game, uh, but they will get on track, and they will ultimately defeat Houston. And then Monday night game, another trash game. New York going to Miami. Who thinks of this shit? Like, really? Fucking terrible game. Should have been Pittsburgh, Cincinnati, or some something better like that. But uh, I have the Giants to come back and win this one, as compared to last week when they choked. So those are my picks. Adios.